Cammie Brown joins us live from Cordy Brothers in Sacramento. Hey, Cammie. Good morning. So it's really amazing to be here at Cordy Brothers because they always have great stories behind some of the things that they have here. So take this wine, for example. If you're wondering why it's called 6100, mm -hmm. it has to do with how many years ago this winery was discovered right here. When did this happen? In 2011, there was an archaeological dig in Areni, Armenia, and they found, in essence, what is the oldest winery in the world. They found buried pots, they found stems, they found seeds of grapes, pressing um, areas, treading areas, um, making it what we know of today as the oldest winery in the world. And so a man came in from L.A. He is from Ar Armenia originally, was living in L.A., came back there and decided, you know what, let's start taking those grapes that are in the region and make a wine out exactly, of them. Exactly, exactly. We discovered this, you know, um, one thing you can always count on in food and wine, there's going to be trends. And a trend now especially with young people and i think maybe the craft market is the craft beer market is kind of indicative of it people like unique things interesting things this wine we discovered daryl cordy spoke at the san francisco wine schools event called the origins of wine history 14 individuals from around the world were there to discuss wines from the the birthplace of wine armenia republic of georgia lebanon israel palestine turkey and by the way that's what all of these wines are that's where all of these wines are from to areas that people maybe don't are not always buying their wine from would never think of this is where wine started this Trinity Canyon 6100 out of over 50 wines we tasted at the grand tasting after the San Francisco wine school event Daryl Cordy was blown away by this wine right now it's my favorite wine blindly most people could not guess what this wine is they think it's, it's a French wine right you know it tastes like a cross between Chinon which is Cabernet Franc and Beaujolais. It is, it is an amazingly delicious wine. Barbecue with cheeses. Um, and, and again, from Armenia, it is really Armenia. incredible. Our customers, yeah. it's been extremely well it's received. Um, if you want to learn more about this, you can go to CordyBrothers.com. You can click on the Cordy TV link. And on the left hand column, go to the Origins of Wine History. There's six and a half hours of content. You can hear Bob Michero, the managing director of LAC Products, the importer, talk about. Armenia give you some detail on the history and how this came to be and I love going to see that because Rick knows his stuff yeah. and what's amazing is if you come here to Gordy Brothers and you're shopping the other people that work here know this as well so if you come and you're like oh this is what I'm making for dinner I want sort of a unique wine to entertain guests they give you a story with the wine and an amazing wine as well you definitely need to come in here if you have not been in plus Rick I mean just come yeah. in to see Rick come on I know you can spend all day there right just I hearing know. the stories and everything. That all right, was thanks, really Gary. good. It's, he's right. It's so different. I've never tried anything like that before. The oldest winery in the world in Armenia. The Bay Breakers uh, is now in full swing. Coming up, we're live from all the action.